What's going on stackers? So in this video I'm going to be sharing with you my colouring book strategy for KDP. So welcome back to Stacking Profits. My name's Paddy and over here we give you the tools and resources to learn, grow and master passive income streams so that you can live a life of freedom. Now, like I said in this video, I am going to be sharing with you my colouring book strategy for researching books. So let's just go straight into this and head over to Amazon. Now, what I've already gone and done is pulled up a couple of long tail keywords which people are searching for so I can show you a little bit more in depth. Now what we're going to be using is self-publishing titans chrome extension. Well one of their extensions. If you want to know more about this extension just here then I'll link a video right there in the right hand corner which you can go through and watch so you can get a better understanding of this Chrome extension. So, right off the bat, I've got a long tail keyword up here, and it's called Bird Coloring Books for Kids Ages 2 to 4. Now, with this, on this Chrome extension, it's saying that the keyword niche score is 47%. Now, with this Chrome extension, they do recommend that you find keywords or niches with a score of 63 and above. Now, me personally, I'm finding niches with anything above 40%, and I'm going to explain why. So that's what this video's about. But first, I'm just going to interrupt this video to say that we have a two week long Black Friday sale on all of our courses, and that the discount is absolutely crazy. So, if you've been waiting for us to have a sale on all of our courses, the time is now, so click that link down below and go through and check it out. Anyway, 47%, we can see that just here. So, why do I go for books with anything above 40%? Well, it's because you can still find some really great niches. Now, this is this niche is kind of high demand, low competition, because if we look here, it says 2,000 results. Now, most people try and go for results under 1,000. That's getting harder to do because there is more and more publishers coming onto the platform every single day. It's not impossible. You still just have to put in a lot of time to find those types of niches. Whereas me, personally, trying to find niches with 40% and above is a lot more easier. Now, why do I actually go for 40% and above? Well, because they're still really great niches. Now with this, this average BSR, I tend to look for anything below 500,000. Now I'm going to explain more in depth about that as well in a second. But if we look through um, the first page, well, let's start here. 47%. There's 2,125 results with an average BSR of 300,000. So if we look here on the left hand side, there's that 2,000 results. But if we actually look through these BSRs, so if we go to here, we can see this is 12,000. That's 2.3 million, so that's a little bit higher. But we can see that the majority are actually really low BSRs. Now, what I actually look for on the first page is BSRs below 300,000 or 500,000. So I just gauge and have a look at these BSRs. So looking at these BSRs, we can see that they're pretty good. So this would be a perfect niche for me. Why for me? Because I now can create coloring books relatively easy and I can smash out about one colouring book per day because I have a system in place. Now if you want to know exactly how I'm creating all of my colouring books and everything that goes along with that then don't forget to check out the LCB Vault and that special offer Black Friday offer that we currently have in because within the vault we do have a brand new colouring book course 
called simple coloring books. So again, if you want to understand exactly everything that I now know about coloring books, go ahead and go and check that out. Anyway, let's take a look at another niche that I've pulled up. So this one is mermaid coloring books for kids ages two to four. This one says 49%. There's 3,000 results. Now, again, with the results, I go for anything probably below 5,000. Now, it all depends on the niche. It all depends on how quick or the quality of the book that I can create around this search term. But a general rule of thumb is anything under 5,000. Because my design skills are a lot better than what they were last year, I have confidence in myself that I could still make quite a few sales when there's quite a few results. So with this one, there's 3,000 results. That average BSR is actually under 100,000. So if we go and take a look at these, go past the sponsored, right here we can see this actually has a rank of 1,420. This has a rank of 607,000. Now again, I try to look for anything on the first page, which is under 500,000. So as long as there's three, four, maybe five books that are under 500,000, I'll go ahead and create that book. Again, I'm going to explain and show you exactly why that is in a second. But if we keep scrolling through, that's not even a mermaid, that's a unicorn. So if we keep scrolling down, 56,000, 47, 4,000. So for me, this would be another really great niche. Now again, I'm going for a niche score of 40% and above. The results anywhere in between one to 5,000, sometimes even more. Again, it all depends on if I believe I can create a good quality book in that niche. But why am I looking for books which have under 500,000 BSR. Well, if you have a handful of books, say 5, 10, 15, 20 colouring books, which all have a rank of under 500,000, you can still make some really good royalties. So what I've done right here is pulled up a calculator. This is a book sales calculator for Amazon. And from my experience, this is the best one out there because I've put my own book numbers in here and they're fairly accurate with my own book sales. So this is the one that I like to use. But from here, let's type in 500,000. And then we're going to change this to book. And then we're going to do calculate sales. So sales per month is 10. And you can roughly make around one sale per day. Now I say roughly because this is just an estimate, but if you have quite a few books with this type of ranking, you can make some really great sales. So let's pull up a calculator. So let's try and work this out. So let's pull this calculator over to here. We have 10 sales per month. So let's say that's an average of $2 per sale. So we're going to do $2 times 10 equals $20 per month from this one book which has a rank of 500,000. So now let's say you have 10 books with that average BSR. That equals $200 per month. So as you can see, by having books with BSRs under 100, nope, under 500,000, those royalties soon add up. So let's go ahead and change this. So let's do 300,000. Let's do calculate sales. That's roughly 16 books per month. So again, let's take that average $2 royalty. So $2 times 16 equals $32 per month from one book with an average BSR of 300,000. So now let's say we have 10 books, all with an average BSR of 300,000. 
that equals $320 per month. So I hope you can see that you don't need to have really that many high demand, low competition books because you can focus on trying to find niches which the average BSR is around 500,000 or less because you can still make some really great royalties. So that's my personal strategy for creating coloring books and doing it this way you find so many more niches that you can go and attack. Now I'm doing this strategy because I enjoy creating books so it gives me something to do during the day, create the books, and because I've created quite a few colouring books now, I can create them relatively easy. Now again, if you want to know exactly how I'm creating them, then come and check out the LCB Vault, because we do have that Black Friday two-week sale currently going on. Now, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Also, go hit subscribe and hit that little bell icon so you can be notified for any further videos. That being said, I've been Paddy, this has been Stacking Profit, and I'll see you again soon.